welcome back guys it's gonna be get ready with me for suffolk um so yeah i'm just gonna go get him in the field now need to shut the gate forgot to shut the school gate um once he's in i'm gonna have a look at him see if he needs a uh, bath i don't think he does i had a look at him this morning he wasn't too bad but obviously he's been out in the field today so he might be a bit dirty but i think i'm just gonna give him a hot cloth um with the well job products we literally live by the well job products they're absolutely amazing um but yeah give him the extra shine he needs to win so we've decided we're gonna hot cloth you aren't we double yeah we're gonna hot cloth him we're gonna use the well gel products aren't we dubs um and we use the shampoo because it's all natural we like the naturalness don't we dubs um and it, lasts, it really lasts um it makes him really shiny so yeah so i've put all the shampoo in the hot water down there i'm just rinsing out the cloth and then we're going to start at his neck then work our way down so he's not a massive fan of it so he's gonna go up and down up and down to get all the um dust to the top of the surface surface like here compared to like here it's a lot shinier so yeah i'm going to time that the whole thing hot cloth in him um i'm gonna give him a little brush off and then put a rug on him because he's shivering because he's a bit of a baby like that if it was the cold don't you dubs so yeah just gonna brush him off right so i've put a rug on him now because he got cold um he's all hot clothed i've did his face he actually was really good for me to do his face he's normally a bit funny about that um oh lala in the background um i'm gonna do his main and towel now i'm gonna use the well gel main and towel um, natural again. Hello. Hey. Also helps with um, hair growth. When we first got double, his tail was very. So it came down to like here thickness, and then it was all like stringy and str like really thin. So it's actually just thickening out at the moment. So yeah, this product's definitely working, and we've seen a difference. So I'm gonna keep using it. I um, don't use the mane and towel spray on his mane because it can make the reins quite slippery and especially when you're racing around it's not the most helpful thing. Um, good boy does. Um, yeah, because obviously it helps hair loss and promotes like hair growth. So it's got quite a lot of like natural oils in it. So it can be a bit, make the reins a bit slippery. So we've got the bug off insect repellent spray here well gel again of course it's also natural um my other horse lala is quite sensitive to um the flies and bugs and all sorts she like last summer she always came in with um fly bites and stuff and with this english weather we had a couple of weeks where it was really hot and there was a lot of flies around um so i use this with her and touch wood this is actually doing the trick for her so yeah this is good and double loves it too <laughs> so i have finished brushing double now he looks very smart thank you dove say hi <laughs> um i've you can see the shine um i've plaited his tail as well um so i'm gonna put him away now say hello to double got a bit of haylage and a bit of hay spoil aren't you dubs and yeah so mum's just packing the lorry at the moment we'll go have a look and see what she's packed um yeah i'm staying the night mum's not mum's coming back but i'm staying at suffolk with double so yeah we've got his saddle and his um gel pad we've got his overgirth we've got his bridle we've got the cap that i'll have to wear um Spare skull cap in case anyone forgets theirs. Um, yeah, and a shirt and pony grand national hat as well. And then that's his feed. So it's 
next morning now and we're heading off to Suffolk today. Um, we're aiming to leave at nine o'clock. Um, it's currently quarter to eight, so we've got about an hour to play with. Um, got to go give double these breakfast. Um, put this in, put this bag in the lorry first. Um, I don't think I showed you what we packed in here. We've packed some wood chips in case there's not any um, bedding. We think it might be straw, but we're not really sure. Um, a bucket, a hail some haylage and some rugs, and then them left my bedding over there. Um, one thing mum hasn't packed actually is a water bucket. <coughs> we need to get some oil or something on that door. We need to put a water bucket in. I know there's a little pink one, but I'll drive him have a bigger one. But yeah. He's got his Land Rover rug on again that he won at Windsor, which is his new travelling rug. We've decided, come and have oh my guy, his haylage. Mum's having some road rage. <laughs> and they come up here inside. No, I've got some up there. There's a horse box. Where? A pink one. Yeah, that's what we just passed. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you waving at them? I don't know, I waved to a horse box. <laughs> They might know them. Yeah, but let's see. yeah, this is the traffic that we're in. What's the arrival time now, Mum? Oh, made up a minute. Do we think we're going to get there before 11 o'clock? It could happen. Do we think it's going to happen? Uh, oh, 10 to five. Oh. Uh, just got to Suffolk. Lucas, why are you in here? Okay, Lucas is in here with Double. Don't really know why. Didn't even see him. But yeah, Double, we haven't actually put any wood chips down for him yet because there's a little grass, isn't there? You've got a So he can just eat the grass for now. He's got his hay ledge and some water. So yeah, we've got you ready at one. Windsor rug. His Windsor rug. Windsor rug. That you won with him? Yeah. You didn't. I, did. I also won one as well. I know, but I got a nice one. They're the same, they're the exact same, exact same rug. This is clean. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, we've got to be ready at 1 and it's 12 o'clock now, so we've got an hour until we've got to be ready. Do we think we're going to win? Yes. We do. Okay. So we are all you just waiting for the race. We're all waiting for the race. Everyone's yeah, yeah, yeah. in the stable, yeah. waiting yeah. for the race. Yeah. Matthew, say hi. Who, are we all excited for the race? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, are you excited? Yes, what excited. heat are you in? Second. You're in the second no, heat? I'm second heat. Second heat. What heat are you? Second. So you're all in the second heat apart from Lucas who's in the first yeah. heat. Are you racing? You're not racing this morning, but you're racing this afternoon and then the other three races. And the walk is very exciting. So we're walking down to the ring now. It's just stopped raining, thankfully, while we're walking. Um, yeah. So, how do you think the race is going to go, Luke? Do you like where you're going down? Not really. We're going down first on the back row again. So, it's a bit annoying, but so it goes. So, we've just done the first race. Um, we're on our way back now. Lucas won the heat. Um, just got out front, stayed out front. It's really tight in there, though. It's quite a small ring. So, having to jump all the jumps and the angle, which is it's a bit annoying because it was just raining, so it was quite slippery in there, but... Double was alright, didn't slip or anything, so it was quite good. But yeah, he had to jump all the jumps on the angle. Then obviously because he won and got qualified for the final. Um, went into the final. Uh, the start was a little bit... There was two whizzy ponies at the front. So why didn't each travel up a little bit? Um, but fine at the end. Good start. Um, then um, stayed on the inside. But he found it quite difficult to stick to the inside because he's having jump jumps like that. Um, but apparently he found it quite easy to see a stride to the fences, so he's really, he's quite happy. But he won. He also knocked a wing over. But at the jump, I was standing that, so I caught him, prodded it back up. Um, but yeah, really pleased.
so I'm just giving last minute brushes. Um, see how shiny he is. Um, just tap tap. Ready for the show. Um, Double's feeling up for it. Aren't you, mate? You ready? You what? <laughs> how was the morning race, Seb? Out of control. This thing is out of control. There's no manners in it. It just does what it likes. Seb, who's your favourite? It's just flea bitten, moth eaten. But who's your favourite? Aren't you dumb? So it runs, it runs all over the shop. Well, you need to control him at the start. It just runs all over the shop. <laughs> out of control. Totally out of control. Right, Dubs, don't listen to him. It's okay, don't You've listen. <laughs> oh god, my hat is not yet. Right. How was the first race, Luke? Where'd you come? First. First in the heat and first in the final. What's the uh, plan for this race? Uh, just getting second give it a nice easy race so that we have control yeah we're going to prove that we have control because new race we do we win the heat we got close seconds close second in the heat and close second, oh, yeah. and close second in the final it was like a photo finish getting an after race feed a sloppy one because sometimes he doesn't drink or eat much while he's away as you can tell we've got a pile of haydage there his hay net is still there so we're just on our way to check up double um so far he's got a first second and a fourth um which we're really pleased with he's showing lots of control and all sorts um double's really being a really good boy to be fair especially down to the starts He's always been in quite, he's been in quite difficult situations and he's just been fine with it all. Uh, as Lucas over there with Vera. Um, don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're hoping, we're in a bigger ring, so we're hoping for a win. But he might be a bit tired now because he has been helping people and like moving out of the way. So it's been quite tiring for him. So we're hoping he's still got a little bit of energy left in the tank. What do you think, Mum? Yeah. Yeah, she agrees. <laughs> a second, second in the heat. And that was like three in a second. Yeah. And then four. Final, we got four. Four. But yeah. It was cruising. We're just trying to save him for today. Well, for this afternoon. Um, yeah. Are you happy with all your positions that you've got down? Well, I've got a good one now. I think we'll have a Oh, perfect. That's the best position because you're not you're not gonna get left behind at the front. You're just gonna get that inside line. Yeah, mum's mum's trying to don't even know what mum's doing over there. Karen doesn't know we have to over there. I put it. I put that. Did your brother get on today, Luke? He fell off. He fell off. What happened? Second. Got into the final. Yeah, he was good in the heat, really he was good. good in the heat, and then he came to the final, he jumped out in front. Yeah, he was in the lane. But he it? flew over the second fence, so it was really hard to turn. And then that and then suddenly turned. Jinxed a bit to the outside. And then it was on the bottom of his neck, and then he lured down, wrapped round front leg, most of the rugby tackle before the <laughs> before the third. The bless him, he got the pony got back up and tried to and carried on the race. <laughs> Oh, he got pulled out. Yeah. But why did he hold on and not let go? Why did he hold on and not let go? <laughs> I think he was scared to hit the dip. No, he told me he thought he could get back on. <laughs> he thought he could get back on. Let's be honest, not even, not even the best jockeys can get back on. Oh, it was funny. I'll, um, shall I put a picture in? Yeah. We'll put a picture of him getting back on. Yeah. <laughs>
down to the race. Bracken's behind us. <laughs> Hi Bracken. Um, we feeling good? <coughs> okay, good start. Feeling good? Double is just chilling. Yeah. How was that race? Good. Good? Very good. Was it good times? Very good. Very good. Where'd you come? Where'd you come? First. Did you both enjoy it? Yeah. 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 How's the start, guys? Very good. good. Very good. Very nice. <laughs> well done, boys. Time. Lucas. It doesn't matter. Oh look, Bean's got double. Oh, we're fighting over double now. It's fine. Oh my god. We're fighting over double, Mum. <laughs> so we are all done. We're just having the last little grey before we put them on the lorries. Oh, He's a bit upset that it's come to an end, aren't you, Lex? You alright, Bean? <laughs> you are a bit weird, aren't you? <laughs> right, come on, Lex. What was your favourite race? Oh, uh, uh, the last one. The one we just did? I think because it was in a bigger ring, wasn't it? It had more of a crowd. Oh, double that one, Lex. Yeah, we had the same crowd. Yeah, had the same crowd, but it was bigger, wasn't it? Yeah. So you had more room to kind of push him to get a bit quicker. Oh, it's Finley! To your pony! Finley! To your pony! Um, I would have beaten him, but I'm not racing. I'll beat him. It's Keisha next, but I beat you at Heathfield. Yeah, true. Neither of you won the first race at Heathfield. And there's a bit in the YouTube video of you going, I'm going to win the first race. Neither of you won it. I still beat her in the second. That is a good plan. Yeah, but now it's been to turn to get her own back on you. Uh, yeah, that is if she gets her own back. He's not going to win like he So His new vlog is Lucas Murphy comes second to Zara Nichols. <laughs> You're ninjas. <laughs> the gingers in here. The ginger ninjas. <laughs> Archie's like, oh, are they going to be friends? Archie's no, Archie's not Sorry, interested. Double. <laughs> <laughs> Don't watch it. How did you, you get on in that race? Um, it went, yeah, it went all right. It was a bit confusing, but I ended up sick. Ah, oh, well done. So I think we're a bit tired. Ah, oh, good though. Yeah. The last checks on the stable. Making sure nothing's in there. All emptied. Everything's gone. We're about to head home.